Okay, good morning guys, or good afternoon rather. I'm a little late getting my video going today. I've had some technical difficulties, but I wanted to welcome you to week two of our distance learning and try to figure out what we've got going this week. Um, just a couple of things before we get started on this week's assignments. Remember that your um, term three grades are posted. You can check active student and that is pretty much what you will see on your report card. If you have any questions or concerns um, in that respect, you may let me know, let your parents reach out to me and we will see what we can do. Um, I do want you to continue to watch the videos on YouTube. Some of those are linked through Canvas. Some of them are um, just on the YouTube page for CMS. Um, for sixth grade, please make sure you're watching the videos before you ask questions because sometimes those videos actually answer the questions for you and actually do a better job than I could do just sending you a typed out message. Um, I know Miss Williams and Ms. James for sure have good videos on how to submit assignments. I have one in there as well. So um, try the video instructions first because they're just a lot better. They have visuals. Um, and if you're still having trouble, contact me. Um, a couple of things about the points contest that we started. I will reassign our ready lessons. Um, you get three points for completing the lesson. You get six points for passing. So if you don't pass the lesson and you need it reassigned, let me know. <clears throat> and I will take care of that for you. Zoom meetings did not count towards your points this past week, but they will starting today, starting this week on week two. Um, remember, you get six points for passing already videos, three points for completing without a passing score, um, five points for each assignment other than aside from already, and two points for any of the extras. Um, I will give, let's say, five points for each Zoom meeting that you attend. Okay? All right. Um, moving on to assignments for this week. I will announce winners in a few minutes. I know that's what you're, you're wondering about, but I, I will announce that at the end. Um, this is your assignment learning board for this week, your assignment board. It is in social studies on Canvas. So, um, and I did change the name of it to include the words assignment board so that that would be less confusing for you. So let's just take a zip through here. You know the white boxes are optional. Those are the two point extras. Um, and the colored boxes are required. Also, be sure that you are checking your discussions and announcements because that's one way that I can get in touch with everybody all at one time. So definitely when you log into Canvas, see if you have any announcements or um, discussions to answer, okay? All right, so just looking at this for reading, we're still on analyzing poetry structure. There is not an already lesson or lesson pages for this week. Some of you didn't do the analyzing poetry structure last week on already, so it's still there. You could get your points this week. If you did do it last week and you got six points for it last week, I will give you those same six points again this week. Um, same thing with the three points. But if you only got three points last week and you want me to reassign it, just let me know. Um, also, there is a Titanium worksheet. That's the song Titanium. Uh, one of the teachers is doing an activity with you um, for that. So be sure that you check. It'll either be Miss Baxter or Miss Perkins. I can't remember which. Then for language arts, you've got your Wordly Wise packet. Um, you're supposed to finish the packet and complete the test. <clears throat> I do plan to Zoom with you tomorrow at 2 p.m. Excuse me, 3 p.m. Sorry, 3 p.m. I'll send out a, a link for you to join that Zoom meeting. 
And during that Zoom meeting, we're going to try to do a Wordly Wise 12 gym kit as a class. So please be sure to try to make that meeting. And I would not take the test. I would not do this complete Wordly Wise test assignment until after we play that gym kit because that'll be a good review for you. All right, then science. Um, Miss James and Ms. Alvarez have uploaded science videos, so please be sure you watch those. Um, CNN 10 is a white box, but it is worth points. As a matter of fact, if you do um, all three days, I'll give you two points for each day. That'll give you six points. Um, then for math, we're on histograms. It's workbook pages 309 to 311. There is the histogram already lesson. And in the math video this week, and the already quiz, in the video this week, I did that one. It says his, it's called Histograms with Miss T. Um, I went through again how to submit your assignments. You download the workbook pages, the whole set of workbook pages and then it shows you how you can click on there to write on them. If you have paper copies, you can write on them and take a screenshot of the paper copies. Okay? But you do need to submit those into um, Canvas where it says Submit Assignment. Um, education games, that's just for fun. Keep your brain rocking. Social Studies, A Night Divided. We're doing chapters 6 through 10 this week. After chapter 8, remember that you'll need to read that or listen to that on Epic or um, through the link in your Canvas file. Or you can actually read the book. There's a PDF. If you prefer to sit down and read, good for you. Get the book and read it. There's a PDF that you can uh, read. Here's another brain break. Um, move to learn. And for writing... <clears throat> you will find your favorite song lyrics, appropriate song lyrics. Identify the rhyme scheme, stanzas, theme, etc. There are more detailed instructions for that in Canvas. Um, for PE, you can learn a new TikTok dance. You can count how long you can balance on one leg, challenge your house, challenge someone else at your house. Um, you can video those and submit. Um, you know, make it fun. Get you two points there. And then art. Draw a picture of what you think your teacher's been doing these uh, last few weeks at home. You can draw. You can make a sculpture. You can whatever, okay? I'm, you know I'm not picky about things like that. I don't want to stifle your creativity. You, if you come up with something better than drawing what I've been doing, fine. Okay, you know I am not hard to please if you come up with a better idea. Music, you will record your poem over the beat that you made last week on GarageBand and share it on Canvas. Okay? So those are the assignments. Of course, you can get in touch with me if you need me. If you are confused about what to turn in, don't forget when you open that assignment, if you'll, when you open this, if you will scroll down, there is a checklist to help you keep straight what all you're supposed to do. And a little schedule if you need it. And I think that's uh, just a quick overview of our assignments for this week. Um, now, I guess the big announcement would be who won the points from last week. We had... Five people, I said I was doing first, second, and third place, and I did, but I had a couple of ties. So, here we go. Drum roll. Third place, tying with 39 points, Carson and Maddie. Way to go. Woo! Way to go. Way to go. All right. And then for second place, I have a tie, 42 points. For Andrew and Abby. Yay, Andrew and Abby. 
had to start with A to get that one. All right, and then in first place, the big winner this week, another drum roll just for you, Will Matthews. Way to go, Will. He has turned in paper assignments, uh, poetry written on sidewalk, lots of different things. So um, great job, and I know that he's been doing PE about every day. So, hey, those points are out there for, for the getting. You just got to get up and get them. I encourage you to get out and move. Not right now. It just started raining. But I do encourage you to get up off the couch, move around, help with a chore or two, surprise your parents, and just have a great week. Miss you. I'll see you tomorrow on Zoom at 3 o'clock. Bye-bye.